Melissa Brennan had a goal. She wanted to visit all seven continents by the time she was 21, and she went to Antarctica. Her last one, she got pictures of a penguin highway. I love the one that just stops. She's like, meh, meh. And, and I like how the rest of them just stand behind me like, anytime, Doug. Yeah. Come on, Doug, anytime. They do a really good job at merging mm -hmm. with each other. We could all learn something from these penguins. <laughs> we could learn how to behave on our highways. Be courteous and patient, but just like in Russia, they do have their mishaps. Oh. <laughs> I love the instant replay that she gives us. Did he get shoved down? There might have been a little bit of penguin oh. check in there. Well, let's ask Melissa what really happened because we have her right this minute via Skype. You're an Arizona State University student. How do you squeeze in traveling to seven continents with school? Every time I had a break, I was constantly planning my next trip, getting on an airplane, trying to find the cheapest flight. Didn't matter to me. I just wanted to get there. In this actual video, we can't see what creates this penguin mishap. Did you see what happened? All of a sudden, just this penguin comes out of nowhere and just hits this other penguin. It literally just hits it. And I'm so glad that I got it on tape because it was hilarious. Did you travel alone to all the continents? No one ever came with you? I've never traveled with my parents. I've joined groups, so I go by myself and then I meet people there. They're usually my age. But um, recently, since I've been 19, 20, 21, I go completely by myself. I stay in a hostel and then meet people that way. Other than watching penguins what else is there to do in Antarctica? I went kayaking about seven miles a day. I went hiking. I visited bases and just stayed on the ship that I went with and met a lot of great people. You forgot the polar plunge. What is it like to uh, jump in the water in Antarctica? We are doing the polar plunge. Antarctica. So we all get in a bathing suit and run in the water. <laughs> It is freezing cold, as you can imagine. It was unreal. I was terrified, I was scared, but you know, it was the coolest thing I've ever done.